So guys, welcome back once again. Now, if you can remember this, before even I greet you. <laughs> okay, let me first greet you. How are you all doing? <laughs> thank you for clicking this particular video. And of course, thank you for loving me, guys. Um, I so much appreciate how much you love me. Welcome back once again. If you remember these potatoes, these sweet potatoes rather, these are the sweet potatoes where we removed from that space where they're doing the bricks. Like I told you, there are some boys who came and joined up with John. So they've rescued me somehow. They've pushed me not to do some other thing. So in other, actually me, I'm cooking for them as they do the bricks. So in the middle of the cooking, I'm also going to work on these sweet potatoes. Um, that was removed earlier on. I left it actually to sleep over for some days. I don't know if it's called wilting or what. I wanted it to wilt. There's a way when it wilts, I don't know. Okay, that is if I mention the right word. Um, it becomes sweet. Yeah, and that is the right one now for making, we call it mutera in my language. I even don't know how to say it in English. But there's a way that we preserve sweet potatoes for us, like especially when it's a lot like this. We cannot eat this in one day. So we preserve it so that it does not go bad. Though, normally what happens, um, this is done like, at, maybe in like Jan there, you get January, or even some people in Feb. But for us, we've decided to do it. I have decided. <laughs> to do it early because we had to clear space for the bricks remember so since these ones are already here in abundance i mean i should not waste this i'm just going to preserve it and keep it in the house normally this is served maybe for breakfast even even for like for real food you can serve this as food with some other sauce but personally i prefer it for breakfast with peanut butter of course <laughs> it's been long since i cooked for you with peanut butter guys so let me just start off um I think you're going to hear some noise in the background. You'll excuse me for that. I can't even stop them. Those are the boys working with John. Okay, let me just pour some water here. So this water right here is what I'm going to use for washing it. So guys, first tell me, do you guys preserve sweet potatoes in your area in any way? Or even if it's not in the way that I'm going to do, how do you guys preserve yours? Hmm? How about you let me know? That is if I told you preserve. For those people who do farming, of course, because definitely, excuse me, you cannot buy from the garden and start preserving. I'm very, very sure. Whoever is does in preservation is somebody who does garden work. So for people who do farming, are you there? Please let me know if you do farming like I do. And then let me know how you guys preserve your sweet potatoes, yeah? Is it the same way that we do ours? Meanwhile, for us we don't only preserve sweet potatoes meanwhile, we preserve a lot of things, even the cassava. But for cassava, normally when we preserve, it is, um, it's for flour. It's always for flour. But this one, when we preserve like this, it is cooked the way it is. Like we don't make, we don't turn it into flour. We don't make it into flour. You get what I'm saying? Yes. Meanwhile, this one is very sweet. Especially the one that has slept over in the house like this. It's really sweet, guys. <laughs> now you know why I carry it somewhat. <laughs> because I'm going to be I'm going to be eating it a lot. So whenever I see me biting it or eating it, just keep quiet. <laughs> That's how I look at my hand is all full of gum from peeling. 
somebody let me know how can I don't even anyone has a hack okay how to avoid this hmm? apart from smearing cooking oil for me I always smear cooking oil if I'm like peeling little but if I'm peeling much like this I don't even bother I just wash it later on with um polythene bag and soap if anyone has any other way of doing it, please let me know so that next time I can avoid it. <laughs> I don't know if you're hearing these boys making noise, they're actually eating. <laughs> I think most of these ones are spoiled, so I'm not going to stress with them. You can see. I'm not going to bother with this. You can see how they are spoiled. Eh? So let me just wash this and then see how to slice them. Oh, how many hours did I spend doing this? Ah, I think like two or something. I don't know. always don't dry it when they're in big pieces like this otherwise it will just end up rotting so the thing is we slice them into small pieces so what I'm going to do next is actually slicing before I can put them to sun dry all right The knife is no longer sharp, the gum is too much on it. <laughs> so guys, have you ever seen this ever before? Like, have you ever seen dried sweet potatoes? Or have you ever tested it? Meanwhile, if you have not, then trust me, you've missed something really nice. You know, it can be really very sweet. And if you take it with black tea, oh, Ooh, I don't know how to describe it again. Just try it and you'll know what I'm saying. <laughs> I like it so much, guys. Let me just do this very fast. Okay, the small ones are for me they're hard to slice the bigger ones at least it's easy that's why you see me selecting the big ones and leaving i'll do these ones last <laughs> So guys, John is going to help me spread this thing. I'm going to spread them up on the roof, on the kitchen roof. So John will help me climb and spread. You can have a look at how much they are. So they'll be sleeping on the roof there. I'll not be removing them. It's already dry season. There's no more rain. So even if I leave it here, no one can steal.
<laughs> John is also eating from up there. So guys, this is how we preserve our sweet potatoes. Let me know how you guys do it. Is it similar to what I just did? I mean, if it's not, how do you guys do it for us? This right here is going to sleep here, even if for a week or even for until it dries properly, that we can pack it in the house and it will not get spoiled. Thank you for watching. <laughs>